Okay, so um, what we've got here, we've got one of these um, Cardine tiles, which is um, damaged. You can see it there. Okay, so I'm just going to show you how to take take this thing up um, quickly and easily. And of course, we're going to use the, the heat gun here. Okay, so this isn't really a plumbing video, but what you're going to do, going along like this. Peel it back like so. Okay, and we're going to do this all the way along and get rid of this. Uh, get get this piece out nice and slowly. Okay. Okay, so we've got our piece out. Okay, put a bit of filler in where it's gone there, and you can see that's still the glue on this side here. There is, if you can see it, just about the old piece. Just try and move it. There you go, you can see it, look, against the, the backdrop. I'm going to use the old piece as a template for the new piece. Also, I'm taking out this little piece here. Uh, I'm going to reuse that uh, in case there's any. I can cut a bit of, I can cut a piece off this end if there is a problem rather than the big piece. So, it's a case of a wood chisel on here, scraping it off. Could use the heat gun. I decided not to, I don't want to damage any of the the rest of the cardine um or do any anything to that um or scrape it off with um anything you can find really okay okay so we're outside very difficult to see but i've put this piece over the other place i'm using it as a template and i've drawn around it with a pencil and i'm going to use it the stanley knife on there okay and um Apparently it just easily breaks. I'm not sure, I've not done it before. So we'll give it a try. This might be a bit tricky, so I've done a, a scowl across there. Take this piece off first, work on this second. Hopefully end up with uh, the perfect piece. So as you can see, I've Stanley knifed it. I'm just now just breaking it. You can see that, I'm gone, sorry. It's just breaking, as you can see. Just looks like you snap it in half to me. It's easy as that. Okay. So it's been Stanley knifed. Just bend it slowly, and it's going to come off in one piece. I might just have to get the Stanley knife and just help it along. But um, I think that's going to be a really a bit of a success, really. There's our piece off. There's the new one. There's the old one, pretty much fit, so we're going to try it now inside, see if we need to take a little bit of a smidges off it, a little bit somewhere. Okay, so we need... Okay, so we need to take a bit off. I'm going to use this um, power file here. Okay, and just take a tiny bit off here and there. <laughs> Difficult for me to film, but we're just taking off about a millimetre or two just on now, round that off, round that off and it should fit perfect. So we're in now, just slid that in. What it's done is uh, we're gonna have to cut this little piece at the end here. Okay, it's just a bit, bit too much and that's probably why it raised up in the first place. So I'll take some off the end here and then it should slide in. I might even give it a bit extra so the problem doesn't happen again. So we'll stick some adhesive on in a minute. So I've marked these off with a pencil. Hardly anything, a millimetre or two. Just take that off now. Okay, so this is now a fit, as you can see. So what we're gonna do is uh, clean up the work area and put the adhesive on. Okay, but not too much. So this is the adhesive. I'm gonna just use some of that. I'm gonna use our modified loyalty car thing that's got nothing on as a spreader because it's only one tile okay okay so we've uh, put our adhesive down and now we're going to slide our tile in okay not done the one at the end so uh, watch and learn hopefully Tap 
Put it down with a hammer. It's very, very tight. So that is a success. Um, what we'll do now is clean it up and put the other tile in. Just cleaning it up a little bit. Don't want all this adhesive to uh, go where we don't want it. Okay, so, you know, leave it on and you'll never get it off. So let's tidy up as we go ahead. So I'm going to do this little bit now. Okay, do the little bit last because it's the easier one to cut, isn't it? Because it's small. It will also give us some flexibility. So it's the last piece to go in now. So uh, I'm just going to slide that in like that. You can see in it goes. I'm just going to bash it down with the hammer a little bit. To all those crucial places. And I'll clean off the adhesive. Here is the finished product. Okay, it's taken about an hour and a half of my time but you've got to be very careful it's doing these little complicated cuts and everything so please like and subscribe it does help the channel thanks